妈妈，妈妈，妈妈，我给你，妈咪，妈妈，妈咪，嘿，今天跟哪部 ？What is this now？ 妈妈，嘿，妈妈，妈妈，爸爸爸爸爸爸爸爸爸爸，妈妈 ，Don't do this, don't do this, don't do this, don't do this, Bobby, 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 wake up, wake up, wake up, oh, hey, 妈妈，妈妈。Listen and listen carefully. The game has just begun. Be on the lookout, Naomi. You monster! Opagi, you have succeeded in hurting my daughter. Now she's in coma. Now she's in coma. Coma how? What are you talking about? How is she in coma? Hey, will you shut up? As if you don't know. Why, who, 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 why are you pretending? Why are you pretending as if you don't know what you did? Just pray. Hello. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Um, my son met the man today with his uncle. Yeah. You know, I am making this call in respect of those uh, materials that you shipped in last week from Canada. Yeah, you need, no, I need to prepare, start preparing myself right now. Yeah, please, I would like you to keep some for me. Immediately I drop this call, I will just send the money to you, okay? And please, I want you to take them to that stylist that is trending now. Yeah, by tomorrow I will drop by her shop and take the measurements. And please, don't forget, you have a traditional wedding to plan. Okay? That's good. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, thank you, Dad. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. What? What is it? It's the Prince, Your Majesty. The Prince? What happened to him? You have to come and see him yourself. Is he okay? I don't know. Mr. Richard, your mother seemed to have struggled a lot with life before she passed out. That's why it's a bit difficult for her to wake up. I understand that, but what exactly is the problem? Uh, uh, don't worry, calm down. We've been able to stabilize her and uh, everything is under control. We also carried out some tests on her. But the result of the tests we carried out are not yet out. Once they are out, we will be able to ascertain exactly what is wrong with her. And by God's grace, we will find a solution. Okay. I, I, was, I was going to ask about the lady in, in Ward 6. Her name is Ruth Namdi. What, what is her situation? Honestly speaking, her condition is very critical. Yes. Her kidney is very bad. Huh? Very, very bad. As a matter of fact, she needs an urgent kidney transplant. It needs to be done as soon as possible. Hi. Her kidney? Yes. Very bad. Ha! Huh. What are we going to do? We? Yes, what can we do? Do you know her? Oh yes, I... She's, she's my girl. 
Oh. Mr. Richard, you really have a lot on your hands. I know. To be very serious, kidney transplant is very expensive. Especially when you're, you know, going to pay the donor. But the donor and the surgery itself, we should be looking at something not less than 10 million. Huh? Yes. But if we are able to get a donor from maybe maybe a relative or friend or something, then maybe the surgery will be a bit lesser. Doctor, we don't have that kind of money. There's nobody in my family that has that kind of money. I don't want her to die. I don't want anything to happen to her. Do you understand? Like, I barely have money to take care of my mother. I don't have that kind of money. Where will I raise that kind of money? How? I understand how you feel, but the truth of the matter is, there's nothing I can do at the moment. Hi! It's... You just need to raise the money for the surgery. As a matter of fact, I will need to engage the services of a, a, pro, a professional who is a specialist in that area. Doctor, you have to help me. How will I raise that kind of money? Hey! Uh, well, maybe we, you can, you know, run around to get some money for us to place our dialysis. From, from where? We, we just, we just let's place our dialysis for like seven days and see what becomes of her. But to be very honest with you, she needs the kidney transplant. And the dialysis I'm talking about, at least we've been even around 100,000 or more. For, for it to happen. I'm sorry, but that's the true situation of things. What is it? You sounded very urgent over the phone. Things are really getting worse. I, I, I... Mama is in the hospital. What? Yes. What happened to her? It's a long story, but bottom line is that the doctor says that I have to make a deposit of 100,000 before they can commence treatment on her. Hi, 100,000? I know. I don't have. I don't know what else to do. Richard. You are the only one that I can run to. I know that you try for me. Okay, but you're like a brother to me, okay? If I don't call on you, who else would I call? Biko. If there's anybody that you can borrow from, just borrow. I, I will pay back as soon as I can get my hands on something. Hi, Richard. Richard, I, I think this is the time that we need Naomi. We need her now. We need help. What? Bao, I don't agree. If Naomi would be my only option, then, then, then it's fine. Hi. I'll sort myself out. Richard, what is it that this girl has done to you? What? Even at a time like this that we need help, you are still proving stubborn. I don't want that kind of help. I want to owe anybody anything. Anyway, I have 110,000 as my life savings. You have? So I'll give you 100,000. Thank you. Oh, yeah, no. let's, go, let's go, let's go, let's go. A lot has been happening in this palace today. I just wonder what it is. Secretive things. Even happiness has been acting well in the queen. <sighs> it's obvious. It's very obvious that something is fishy. But we need to find out what. Yes, since that celebration you talked about. Yes? I've not even seen the prince. Even <laughs> Ichio Menma has been here since. What is really going on? Hmm. We'll find out soon enough. Enough. Soon enough we'll find out. I mean, I don't get it. Something is going on. You guys should be very, very careful. 
before they will sell us in this compound. I am the only child of my parents, Bikun. Eh? Happy, happy mama. We come now. Where are you going? I've not seen you since morning. The fattest girl in this compound. Fine, yeah. Happy, what's up? What is it? Madam, be coming down. You know you are acting too official with everything. Anyways, happy. Happy, please. I didn't call you for us to fight, okay? Tell us now what is going on in the compound. Like you've not seen the prince for hours now. You've not, you've not heard from him. Is he okay? What is going on? We are just consigned maidens. That's all. <laughs> consigned maidens indeed. I will advise you all should go back to your individual post and mind your business. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at this fat, fatty bum bum. Because she called you fine girl, that's why you are ranting. That's why you are talking rubbish, Abi. Come on, look at out. Osebego. Osebego. It's not your fault. Don't uh -huh. think she knows how to do this too. Eat our yes. food. If the queen asked her to give us food, she just give us half fashion and oh finish the whole food and said, Look at half half fashion is I don't even know why I called her. So guess you've seen how it is now. She don't want to tell us anything. See what you will do. I will advise you to put your ears on the ground. Put your ears on the ground. Make sure you record every details of who is going out and who is coming in. Let's know what is going on now. We can't be in the compound and all these things will be happening. How do you go? We don't know what, as in, I don't get it. What? You mean he, he did that? Uh, 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 okay, okay. Uh, thank you for the information. Uh, yes, uh, my wife and I will be there very soon. Thank you. Until uh, then. Uh, What exactly is going on? Ah, uh -uh. no. What is going on? When did you even come back? A few minutes ago. I just got up the phone with the doctor. Doctor? Yes. What did he say happened to her daughter? Nothing. Uh, he just informed you that, that that stupid boy, Richard, just paid the 100,000 naira needed for root dialysis. What? Huh? No. No. But this boy keeps surprising everyone. Are you sure he is not into dirty deals? Because, come to think of it, how was he able to raise 100,000 naira cash in just like this? The question should be, why must our daughter's life always revolve around that food? Why? Why? No. Mm. That, you're, you're, you're right too. But um, on the second thought, it doesn't concern me. I didn't send anybody to the market. So I owe no one any welcome. Whatever he likes, let him do. That does not change the fact that he will not marry my daughter. In fact, even Mother Mary will forbid that he will. He will not. Mother Mary forbid. Mother Mary forbid that he will marry my daughter. For my dead body. But not when I'm alive. Will he marry my daughter? Marry my daughter. Hi. Hey. Even if I die, my spirit. Was one no no. Hi. So, were you able to raise some money so that we can just pay him off? A nation will bear us witness that we are not owing him anything. A hunter disappointed me. He said he has um, he has um, an emergency. Huh. How can this come up now? Eh? How can this come up now? I'm scared though. <laughs> you don't have to be. Thanks to the God that it didn't happen when we want to see who can. That would have been the end. I mean it. That would have been the end. Hey! What is all this? So now, please, if I may ask, 
what are we to do? Because this might lead to disaster in future. Please, what can we do now? Please. I think I will look for a powerful Dibia, not minding the kingdom, to tell us the root to this problem. And an eternal solution, because this is not something that we need to manage when it becomes king. Exactly. Exactly, my brother. You know, we need to act, we need to act fast and very fast. Please, please, and please. Biko. Don't worry yourself. Leave everything to me. I'll get to the root of this. Oh, thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thank you. It's okay. <laughs> I beg to leave. So you see that life without you will have no meaning. Please, baby. Fight. Like a warrior that you are. Because I know that you would not give up on our love. Please keep fighting. I miss you. We all miss you. Your family misses you. But I miss you the most because you're the one who makes my heart beat. But lately I wake up in fear with my heart racing. Fear of the unknown. Not knowing if the last time I saw you would be the last time that I will see you. Baby, please. If you fail to fight, then I am finished. Please come back to me. It still baffles me that despite all the emotional pain that my wife and I have subjected this boy to, he is still not bothered. I mean, what kind of a man is that? He has been nothing but good to this family. He paid for my daughter's dialysis, 
not minding the fact that his mother was in the hospital and that we will never ever treat him right. What do I do as the man of the house? Truth be told, I, I owe him a lot. Should I give them my blessing to compensate for all that he has been doing? <sighs> but considering my financial state, I mean, how can the poor marry the poor? I think this mission is impossible. No. I cannot allow that to happen. Mm -mm. Greetings, elders in council. Your Majesty, where is the prince? We've been waiting for him for a very long time now. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. And I sincerely apologize. I think the prince will not be joining the meeting today. You have to reschedule the meeting, please. As, as jobless men? No, as lazy people who do not have anything to do. No, we don't have anything to do. Yes. Akwigbo, are you high on something or what? How dare you address the crown queen of this kingdom in such a manner and tone? Who are you? Ablo, Ablo. What's your problem? Ablo. Ablo. I want you to stay off my path whenever I'm dealing with matters of this kingdom. Stay off my path. No, how can elders of this kingdom fix a meeting and the supposed king or the supposed chairman will just reschedule it without any reasonable point? No, it's a slap on our faces. Did you ask for a reason and it was not given? Must you constitute nuisance any time and all the time? Why? Who do you think you are? Ozurumba! If you don't have anything reasonable to say, Aku is making a very vital point. What nonsense vital point are you talking about, Donatus? Eh? It's insulting the queen. What you refer to as vital point? Who invited a rat in the meeting of lions? Huh? That you are the brother to the late king does not give you the right to talk when men are talking. Men of this kingdom are talking. Are you out of your senses? Huh? Oh, because you are called uh, Akubo. Your head is swelling, isn't it? Look, in the first place, what have you achieved in this life, if I may ask? I, I know your gluten is on that true. And that is going to be when I am dead. Then you shall die for it to happen. You must die. I show you that. He will not die. He will, he die. will not die. You must even join him. He will die. die. But it must happen. It's you. What took no sense? You must surely die. I show you that. Surgery, doctor. Surgery, how? Um, Mr. Richard, to be very sincere with you, your mother needs urgent surgery. The disease has eaten deep into her vital organs. If nothing is done, we might lose her. Mm -mm, please, I don't, I don't want to lose her. I don't want to lose her. I cannot lose my mother. Then we need to carry out the surgery immediately. Hi. Doctor, okay. This surgery is like, like how much? 275,900. 
and it needs to be done as soon as possible. Emphasis is on the word urgent. As regards your girlfriend, Ruth, her case is becoming more critical. Remember I told you that over the phone last night. So, you need to do everything possible to ensure that we save them. On our part, we have tried to administer some drugs and all that, and all that kind of care we could you know, afford to give them without funds. But right now, money is seriously needed. So I beg you to please go and look for money so we can do the need for. Remember I told you that we need a specialist to carry out the surgery because I'm not the one to do it. Whatever you have to do, do it fast. I understand you don't have money, but there's nothing we can do at this point. You need to ask first. Please. Why did you ask me to stop coming to your house? Stop seeing me! You know that is not possible! You can never take my man from me. You have really gone bonkers. Hey, 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 hey. Get out! I told you I'll be back! And I'm here to collect whatever I get to my kidney, my cup. I'm in it now. Enough of you clown to see this. What is it? This is going to be my last visit, last warning to destroy your family. All I am saying is, please, Father, give him a chance to make his right with us. The child you have is mine. <gasps> no. I am Junior's biological father. <laughs> he just tried to destroy our home. There is no way I will allow this beast in a human form, not in my daughter. Johannes, he hurt me so much when he don't even know me. That is because you're nothing but a distraction. And the doctor confirmed that Kingsley here cannot impregnate a woman. Huh? I'm here to know if my request has been granted to marry your daughter. I've already found a suitor for her. You made that decision on your own. I did not approve of it. Must you follow my son? Don't, 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 don't everywhere he goes. If you were man enough to stand up to your mom, she will not be here bossing your wife around. You know, here the last time when Oka sound warning, they make I know I want to inside this compound. I will not be alive to see someone touch you. Who is this one? Who are you? What God? Mother, I am an adult. I have the right to decide. Stop telling me who to live my life with. This is 25 million naira. Take it and allow me marry your sister. You think you can just buy us over just like that? After you what you did to my son? Don't tell me you meant every word you said in there. Your parents are very ungrateful. So you're going to return my kidney and my cornea. Else, I will bring down this house. 